Hey YouTube Nation, doing another video here. This one I'm going to go through and do collections, what I have in my collections. I'm going to start off with uh, the DC and uh, go in alphabetical order. It's just too much of a too much to go through and try to get everything pulled out of my collection here. So it's going to be a, a, a series of videos that's going to go throughout. I'm going to start off with, with DC like I said and then go into to Marvel and then all the independents. But the first one I've got here is uh, the Batman Family number 6. This is the first appearance of the Joker's daughter. Second one I got here, Batman: The Killing of Joker. Uh, this is the first uh, first print. Really high grade. This one right here. This is Batman number twenty. This is a variant, one in one hundred variant. It's got the Scott Snyder and Greg Capello. This is Batman number 612. This is part of the Hush series. Uh, this is actually a pretty pricey comic. I think it goes for, uh, I think, 20 bucks or something like that. I've got two of these. Um, this one's 612 and, and the 608. Um, this is another, this is the beginning of the Hush series here. But uh, both of them, I think they run about 20 bucks. This is the, uh, they've got a second print print of the 608 which is a little bit more expensive but um, I've got the two Batman 627 and 628 this is the old death in the family it goes Batman 251 and Joker cover it's Neil Adams um, he's the one who drew the cover for this one right here Batman 227 this is a cover swipe from Detective Comics I believe it's number 31 uh, that one's a little bit too pricey for me to pick up even in in poor condition good condition things are a couple thousand dollars but this one right here I've always liked this cover uh, this one can get pretty pricey the higher you up you get I think I've this one I think I've got at a seven five or something like that so it's not too bad a shape but I've got a little color break right here but overall, I mean, the comic's really nice, really clean comic. Got this one, Batman 181, first appearance of Poison Ivy. We got two copies of these. Did an earlier video, kind of like the Penguin there. It's one of my favorite uh, characters there from, from Batman. This is the first Silver Age appearance of him. So, it's Batman 155. So another character I'm getting into now too is the Atom. This is number 29. This is the uh, Golden Age appearance of Atom. There's another Atom. This is number three. This is the first appearance of Kronos. I got this one. Uh, it's got a $50 sticker on it, but it was the old comic store there. They had a half off, so I went up there and picked up them some comics. This one right here, Aquaman number 45. No significant to it, but I just, I really like the cover art on it, and that's the reason I picked this one up. Uh, this is a higher grade, probably a, an 8.590, but I just really love the cover art on this, and sometimes I'll just pick up a, a comic if I, if I'm attracted to it, so this is one of them. And I picked up two of these. The Black Manta, first appearance of Black Manta, Aquaman number 35. These are starting to go up, go up in price. This one I picked up from Chicago Comic Con, Aquaman number one. It's got some writing on it right here. I think a couple, yeah, replacement staples here. Not in the best of shape, but Aquaman number one, I'll, I'll upgrade that one. All-Star Western, first appearance of Jonah Hex, another key comic. I think Lightning 2288 just did a video here recently and had that one in there. Here's All-Star Comics, first appearance of Power Girl. 
This is in, in really good shape too. This is probably at least a 9-0. Adventure Comics, first appearance of Karate Kid. This is uh, number 346. This one's not in the best of shape. This is one of those creases that they got when they shipped them in the mail. This one right here I picked up. Detective Comics number 400, first appearance of Man Bat. Really love the cover on this one, but this is a key comic. Uh, and this one's a high grade. This is, uh, I believe, a 9-2. Uh, at least 9-2. Really nothing wrong with it. Everything on this is sharp. No color breaks. But Man Bat, I've always, I've always liked Man Bat. Uh, I had to pay a little bit for this one, but w was willing to with it being such a, such a high grade. Uh, Vengeance of Batman. I got this one in a these next ones I've got in hard plastic just because they're they're higher grade, uh, at least nine sixes. So I didn't want to take a chance on having them in my box and getting dinged up. I'll get these sent in and graded eventually. Here's another one, Batman: The Dark Knight Falls. This is a series of one of four series. This is number four here. The same thing, got in the hard plastic. Really good shape. So number three. So number two. And number one. Like I said, these are all high grade. This one's in really good shape. I opened this up when I when I first got it and it, it looked like it's never been read or even the comic's never been opened, so I put it straight in the in the plastic there to make sure nothing happens to it. But that's all I've got for now. Like I said, I'll continue to do videos and, and go through my collection here. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.